cowboys and cowgirls. I'm Cowboy Jack, and today I'm really excited. Do you see where we are? We're at Bucky's in Katy, Texas. You know what Bucky's is? It's a great gas station chain with all kinds of fun stuff. This one is really unique because you know what they have? The Guinness Book of World Records longest car wash in the world. Take a look at it over there. It's really, really long. And you know what? They said we can drive through it and show you what it's like to go through. I'm here in my truck. See, it says Cowboy Jack right there on it. Come take a closer look. So if you ever happen to be driving around and you see me, give me a wave because I'm probably just cruising around. But my problem today is I'm here at Bucky's, the longest car wash in the world, and my truck is really dirty. Look at that. Ew. All right. Well, let's go get it cleaned up. Come on, you can come in my truck with me. Here we are in my truck. What's the first thing you do when you get into a vehicle? You gotta buckle up for safety. So here we go. Put my safety belt on and I'm gonna start it up. Next thing we gotta do is drive up and pay. I mean, they're not gonna let me wash my truck for free even though I'm Cowboy Jack. So let's go ahead and pay and, and then we can go into the car wash. All right, well, I need my wallet so I can pay. All right, so I went ahead and paid and I got this receipt and they're gonna scan this barcode and it's gonna let us go through the car wash. Here we go. See, and he's directing us on how we need to turn our wheels and make sure we're getting in here nice and straight. They're really nice. I'm glad they were here to help us out. So here we go into the car wash. Look, there's a beaver right there. I think this is the first soap coming on us right now. Wow, you can't even see through the windshield right now. Oh, look, there's a beaver going on the windshield right there. This is really cool. You gotta keep your head on a swivel because there's a whole lot to see in here. Looks like we're getting a little bit more soap. Lights? Wow, there's all kinds of different lights and colors going on. Oh, here comes some brushes. Here comes some more brushes. Whoa, I see pink, yellow, and blue. All these different colors right on my windshield. And I bet you it's getting really, really clean. Whoa, it's washing all those colors off. This is really neat. It can be kind of noisy when you're going through a car wash. But it's nothing to be afraid of. It's actually really, really fun. This is so cool. Look at all these big brushes coming right here on my window. I bet they're getting my window really, really clean. Ah, I think one's about to come and spin like this right along the hood of my truck. Whoa, there's a lot of colors with that too. Those brushes are spinning so, so fast. And this is such a long car wash, it's hard to say if we're almost done or if we're just getting started. That brush was really loud. Looks like we're about to see some more colors. There's red. 
blow air really, really hard at the truck and move all the water right off of it. sign right up here and it's telling me to still wait because it's still drying my truck. I think once the light goes on the green one that says go, then we'll go ahead and put it in drive and drive away. Alright, now it says go. So I'm putting it in gear and we're going to drive off. That was really fun. I bet my truck is so clean on the outside. But what do we do now? We gotta get it clean on the inside. They have all these really nice vacuums over here that we can use because we went through the car wash. Let's go ahead and find a good spot. This looks like a good one right here. Alright, we can take a look and see how clean my truck is now. Those brushes did a really great job. Look right over here. It looks like it's sparkling fresh. And look, my cowboy jack part is really clean. That's great. Alright, well what you do is you take that same ticket that we used to pay and you go scan it so the vacuums are clean. Alright, it looks like I've got eight minutes to vacuum. I don't need that long. Alright, here we go. See, this is a vacuum. It sucks really hard. So all that dirt and stuff that my boots dragged into my truck, I can get out right now. There, I think that looks a lot better. We got a lot of those crumbs out of my seat. Did you see how dirty it is in there? That's because my little boy, Caden, really thinks it's funny to throw stuff all over my truck. I hope you don't do that to your parents. All right, well now that we've cleaned the inside and we've cleaned the outside, let's go take a close up look and we can see what all these brushes do um, while we're not inside the truck. So now let's take a close up look at the car wash now that we're not in a car. We found somebody who's going through and taking their car to get clean and they said we could watch alongside of it. It's going to be really fun. Did you know that this car wash is 255 feet long? That makes it a Guinness Book of World Records longest car wash. You ought to look it up with, your, with an adult on the internet and you can read all about it. It's really neat and you can find other world records too. Let's go see the car get clean. So if you remember, right when we first started going through, we got a really soapy spray. His car's getting a really soapy spray now. Take a look. All those brushes are doing all the hard work.
so many brushes that move around the soap and get it really, really close. This is such a great car wash. If you're ever in the area, you ought to come by and check it out. A lot of people think car washes are kind of scary, but we just went through one together. Did you get scared? I didn't. It was a whole lot of fun. And they even had that Bucky symbol that flew down my windshield, and we had those different lights and colors going on. It was a whole lot of fun. Look, he's still getting brushed off. All right, well that was so fun getting to watch a car go through from the outside so we could see all the spinny brushes, all the soap spraying down, all the different colors and all that fun stuff that we saw from the inside on the outside. All right, well this has been really cool and I'm glad we got to check out this world record car wash. Now, let's go on inside Bucky's and we can see what they've got to do inside. It's kind of a long way over there so I think we ought to take my shiny new truck and drive it over there, let's go. All right, well now that we did the car wash, let's go on inside. Whoa, do you guys see what that is? Look at this guy, look at this guy. This is my buddy Bucky Beaver. This is a statue of a real beaver, how fun is that? Let's see if you buy, ah. oh, he almost got me. All right, let's quit playing around and go inside. We've got a whole lot of things to see, and we're gonna get to see some really cool stuff, so come on. Wow, Bucky's t-shirt's right inside the front door. How cool is that? If you ever need a good ice chest, Bucky's has got a lot of them. They keep a lot of stuff around here. All kinds of things that you might need for your house, for the indoors. You know what? I hear they even have a few toys in here that we might take a look at. Guys, there's all kinds of toys and things for kids right here inside Bucky's. Come take a look. I found an alligator. Chomp, 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 chomp. <laughs> and they have all kinds of other stuff too. Hey, you know what? I've been feeling all day like I got a monkey on my back. There he is. <laughs> This was really fun. Let's keep looking around. They've got all these different games and like backpacks and towels. You think Cowboy Jack would look good in this shirt? <laughs> you know what? I think my little buddy Caden already has this shirt because we love Bucky's. You guys like sloths? Are they fast? Are they slow? What do you know about sloths? They're really slow. <laughs> snakes all over the place. Look how long this thing is. All right, that's enough looking around at the toys. Let's go see some of the other really neat stuff they have. All right, we're here at the Texas Roundup. That's where they make all their barbecue and buckies. Let's go check it out. Wow, there's a lot to see. Oh, look who it is. Oh, what's up, my friend? Hey, how are you? Awesome, great to see you. I heard you're coming to make the ultimate brisket sandwich. You're gonna let me make the brisket sandwich? Let's do this, are you ready? Okay, <laughs> Let's go. here it goes. Hold on, we got it before you get started. We're gonna have to apron you up. We right. don't want to dirty up the outfit. I wouldn't want to get barbecue sauce on yeah. <laughs> Check that out, it's got a Bucky Beaver right on the front of it. How cool is that? Do I look official? <laughs> All right, you ready? I'm ready. Hold on. 
You gotta have gloves. You gotta glove up. All right. You gotta have gloves. I can't go touching anything with my dirty hands. I got gloves. Let me put them on. Wait a minute. Before we do that, did you wash your hands? Gotta wash your hands. Give me those back. So many rules. All right. Sorry, man. All right. Look, and I got that, my soap. You gotta soap up for at least 20 seconds. All you right. can sing the birthday song if you like. That's about 20 seconds. Hmm. I don't know if I want to sing the birthday song. Uh, let's just count. We're counting. Do they look clean? They look good and clean? All right, I think so. Turn that off. Now I gotta dry my hands. They were really wet. All right, is that clean? Looking good, looking All right. good. All right, so now, two set, set of gloves? You handle that, right? I can put on gloves, I've done it before. Awesome. Maybe. All right, now I got my gloves on. Is that good? Let's go. All right. So meet Chandler. Hi Chandler, I'm Cowboy Jack. Nice to meet you. <laughs> All right, what are we doing today? We're gonna chop a brisket. I'm gonna chop a brisket. That's gonna be really cool. All right, so first thing we do, Put the brisket on the board. All right. Hold on. Here we go. Chandler, you ready? We got fresh brisket on the board. Fresh brisket on the board. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Put it back in the drawer. You didn't holler fresh brisket oh, on the board. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's my first okay. day. I know. Oh, we got you. We got right. you. Okay. okay. Ready? We're going to do it all again. Ready, Chandler? Yes. Let's do okay. this. We got fresh brisket on the board. Fresh brisket on the board. All right. Now we're ready to break it down. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Well, I hate to tell you, knives are sharp. So we're going to have to leave it to a professional or an adult. All right. Well, I guess I'll sit this one out. Wow, come take a look at that. She looks like she knows what she's doing. So she's breaking down a brisket right now. And what she's going to do is she's going to she's going to actually slice it in little slips so she can look for fat. Fat is flavor. We want a little bit of fat, but not too much. Okay. And I think that's actually called the flat, right? Exactly. That's the flat. And this right here is the point. So that's the lean part of the brisket, and that's the moist. This guy knows his meats. <laughs> we got fresh chopped brisket on the board. Fresh chopped brisket on the board. You guys see the steam coming off of it? That's because it's so fresh, it just came out of the smoker. <laughs> wow, what are you doing now? I'm gonna put barbecue sauce in it to make it our chop brisket. Oh, cool, I'll grab the sauce. It's really, really hot though. So oh. I would suggest adding probably. Uh, I can't grab the sauce either because it's really hot, so she's gonna do it for us. saying for everything and you gotta yell it out real loud. Just enough sauce right there. Watch this. Now comes the mixing. Okay, 
Wow, that sauce is getting all over every single piece of meat. I bet it's gonna be really, really tasty. That's cool. Nice. We're gonna get to see how to make a brisket sandwich. Have you ever made a brisket sandwich before? I haven't, so I'm gonna learn how today. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, so. So we take a nice healthy scoop, okay? You put it right there on the top. Wow, that's a big scoop. Oh yeah, we want to make sure we fill that butt up. We lay that there. Now, I got one for you. Ready? I'm ready. Do you know how to wrap a brisket sandwich? I think I can fake it. <laughs> we'll leave that to our professionals. We got one right here. Okay. All right. Ready? Yeah. I mean, I can't mess with knives. So, I can't so mess with hot stuff. I don't really want to try to wrap up something that I've never wrapped up before but we got professionals here to do it for us. So Kaylee's right here. She's going to show us how to do it. So she's going to take this and wrap this sandwich up. And I just figured out what you can do. What Are you ready? I, yeah. I got it. Watch this. This is going to be so great. All right. So I want you to come over here to this little computer. Right. And click chop brisket sandwich. Oh, click one. Right there. Print label. Hey, I know how to print a label. What do we do now? Just stick it on there? You're gonna take it right here. You're gonna go here and just wrap it on there. All right. Watch. I'm gonna put the sticker on it. And then you're what? gonna slide it right on over here. Look. Hey. I made a brisket sandwich. All right. Great job. Woo, that was a lot of fun. Hey, thanks, Randy. I appreciate you having us. Oh, it's our pleasure. Come back anytime. All right, thanks a lot. Well, you can't come into Bucky's without getting something really special. You see what that says? Beaver nuggets. Beaver nuggets are awesome. They're kind of like caramel corn, but they're even better. But. All that making a brisket sandwich really worked up an appetite for me, so I'm gonna take these as a snack. But they also have some healthy snacks here too, because it's important to have healthy snacks. Let's go check them out. Look right here, they have all kinds of different healthy foods. Like pineapples, grapes, watermelon, even a couple of salads. Wow, these salads look really tasty. You know what? I'm a sucker for a good cantaloupe cup. I love cantaloupe. I'm gonna go ahead and grab one to take with me and eat. And I'm sure I am thirsty. Putting that sticker on the brisket sandwich was a lot of work. I need something to replenish my thirst. They have a whole lot of different drinks here. I think this one should do. This is a large. It's got the bucky right on it. I'm gonna go ahead and get a little bit of ice. Hmm, what do I want to drink today? Pepsi Zero sounds good. If you're feeling real daring, you could add one of these flavors to it, but I'm not really thinking about that right now. I'm just gonna drink the plain old thing. Let me get a lid and a straw. Got my lid, got my straw. And we are good to go. Hey, I saw a whole bunch of beef jerky and other items they have here. They have like a whole bakery 
and a whole lot of other cool things. Let's go look at those before we take off. Look at all these different muffins, cookies, and even kolaches in here. Here's more kolaches. If you've never had a kolache before, it's kind of like a breakfast biscuit with a piece of meat in the middle of it. It's, they're real popular here in Texas and they're really good. And then do you guys like beef jerky? Because they have every kind of beef jerky you could ever imagine. Some of it's not even beef. Let's take a look. Look at that, turkey jerky. That's made out of turkey. They've got some dried sausage up here. That's really tasty. Wow, that was really neat. Now that I've got my tasty snack and my healthy snack and my drink, I think we're ready to take off. We've had so much fun here. Let's go. All right, guys, well, we've had so much fun here today. We actually got to go through the world's longest car wash, all 255 feet of it. That was really fun. And we got to see what it looked like from the outside. And then I, I even got to go inside Bucky's and pretend like I worked there for a little bit. I made a brisket, well, okay. I didn't make the brisket sandwich. Somebody made it for us. But I did put the sticker on it and it was really cool. Well, it's starting to rain out here, so we're gonna take off. But I'm so glad we got to hang out here at Bucky's today. If you had a good time, go ahead and subscribe to Cowboy Jack on YouTube. And I hope to see you again real soon. But until then, yeah!